what was your what were you seeing that led to that shift in in creating the agency so <laughs> it's actually a funny story i i started the agency on accident um is what i like to tell people because yes. What happened in 2019 was I was just looking for a new job. I was in a very rural area um, in Illinois, was trying to move back up to the Chicagoland area. And so my I had jumped onto LinkedIn to update my digital resume because up until that point, that's all LinkedIn was, was a digital resume. And what happened was I, I landed on the feed and noticed that people were actually starting to create content on the platform. And I've been a content creator for decades. And I was like, well, heck, the best way to stand out and get a new job is if I like show people I know marketing and branding. And so I started creating content around that with the, the intention or the goal of landing a new job. And what was happening was I was getting all of these founders in my DM saying, hey, I don't have the money to hire a marketer. I don't have a marketing team. Can I hire your agency to like help me with something? And I'm sitting there like, uh, yeah, the agency that doesn't exist. Um, we <laughs> definitely could do something. And like, I had always done some marketing and branding stuff on the side of a full-time job. Like ever since I had a full-time job, I was doing little bits on the side because where I, where I lived, there really wasn't a marketing agency around like the the closest one was an hour away the better ones were three hours away and so mm -hmm. a lot of companies especially these mom and pop stores needed design work done they needed some messaging help they needed like just branding help 